Hey YouTube, it's Chuck. Going to do a little bit of voiceover with some Tesla ADAS testing today. Uh, got a little bit of drone footage. Here you can see just a neighbor driving an unprotected left turn crossing into three lanes of traffic with no traffic. Perfect, easy, all the way into the right lane. Not much to say about there. But I've got a lot of footage here of the Tesla Black Model Y doing some turns. And I think we saw some interesting new stuff today. Let's take a look at what we see. All right, here's the uh, first run here I've got. And you can see the stop line being honored and with a little bit of sleep, slow creep behavior there coming all the way up to the creep stop line with a pause. And look at this right turn and then the pose in the median. That little right turn is what I want to talk about today because it looks like it's getting it in a better position to make an angled uh, pose in that median. It looks really, really good. This is low traffic, not a whole lot to deal with, but the lateral maneuver is what I think is impressive to see here. It gets it in a good position to succeed uh, in even in higher traffic. Here I'm just kind of going 800 times speed so you can see the local traffic. And uh, in this situation, we got another local uh, driver doing an unprotected left turn uh, for reference only. Pretty easy, light traffic, not much of a big deal, but we do these all day long here. All right, here we come again, and the Tesla car should be coming up. And I think what we're going to see uh, in this next scenario is more good creeping behavior. It's honoring the stop line, and the creep is coming all the way forward with a nice weight. Here's a, here's a good high-speed car coming in the far right lane. Decent. It's close, but it, it's a good stop position. It's about as far forward as I would ever be comfortable, but it definitely is creeping to the limit to get its best advantage for the B-pillar camera here. And once it finds a gap, it's using this nice pose maneuver where it's taking a slight right and then coming back to the left to get in the median. There it is, slight right, back to the left, with a continuous roll that time because there was no traffic, stayed straight in the left lane. These are uh, what I would call gimmies for the unprotected left, but let's look at the uh, lateral maneuver that they're actually programming here. I think that's the highlight for the day. Here we have a scenario where we have a local driver taking a right turn and the Tesla car is now stacked up back, honoring the yellow line, trying to get out to make the left turn. This local driver, uh, I've watched this a few times, is a little hesitant to get in that right lane, much like the Tesla is. Um, so he's waiting. He's waiting on the right opportunity to jump out. The Tesla can't quite creep up yet because there's just not quite enough room to squeeze by, but it's waiting patiently. There was a big gap there, and he still chose not to go. Humans wait, too. All right, there's the proceed on the right turn. Now the Tesla can creep further forward. All the way to the creep line. And continue. Small right turn. And the pose in the median. With really good placement on this one. This is probably the best median placement in this clip. And then proceeds into the left lane. You got an unprotected left turn following. Notice how he did almost the exact same pose with just a slight roll into the left lane there. These are great examples of both ADAS and human drivers that are unscripted. A little bit of 800 speed here through the local traffic. Just you get a reference of the traffic on a Sunday afternoon. This is at about 3 p.m. on Sunday here in Jacksonville. And here we go again. Should honor the stop. And then the creep. Car coming in the closest lane. Completely honoring that. Slight right turn, pose, a little bit of a tail sticking out, but it was in the lane, but not as well as it was in the previous one, and it continued to the left lane. I'm very, very happy with that. 
if the Tesla team was watching this, any of the ADS drivers doing this work, I really, really appreciate all the work you guys are putting into this. I hope that these videos maybe even give you a, a different perspective into the work that you guys are doing. Uh, I know you don't have uh, cameras out here in the locations. You're basically just taking data from the cars. If this is contributing, I know you might not be able to tell me, but uh, I, I hope it's helpful. All right, here we go again. We got the uh, black Model Y stopping at the line with a nice creep here with a very open scenario to the left with a roll, slight right, continuous all the way through. We've shot many of those uh, gimmies where when it's wide open, it just continues the roll. That was a great maneuver. Not much to say there. It doesn't get any easier than that. All right, here we go again. Nice stop, slow creep. Continuous roll, a little right, a little left with a pause. Tail is just next to the yellow line, but ooh, it came a little bit further forward that time. So it looked like it was gonna stop. That's a perfect position there from this drone's perspective while it waits on the traffic from the right. Proceeds in the left lane, nice acceleration. I am 100% convinced these are all being driven by the car, just by the behavior of the car. There is no interventions going on that I've seen to this point. Here we go again with a stop, slow creep. Slight right. Tail sticking out a little bit there. I wouldn't call that the best situation. It should have scooted up just another uh, few feet, and then it proceeds into the left lane. Interesting, the inconsistency on where it decides to stop. I wonder how it's doing that math. Hey, I appreciate you guys watching. We'll talk to you next time.